inside the Yakuza, Japan's most dangerous gang. Let's see. Oh, wow. When you think of Tokyo, the hood doesn't really come to mind. There are some dangerous places here, but it's relatively safe due to tourism. But three hours southwest on express bullet train and away from most tourism will lead you to one of Japan's biggest cities, Nagoya. Osaka, which to locals is known as the hood of Japan. Osaka's Today, the hood? I thought Osaka sounds cool. We're gonna link up with Tiga Sky Sea, a local rapper who's gonna show me around Osaka and then later connect me with one of the world's most dangerous gangs, the Yakuza. Oh, Make sure to take damn. the thumbs up the video right now, y'all. Yo, I'm gonna take the two seconds, dummy. Okay. Let's yeah. see. All right, y'all. So we just got to Osaka right now. We're about to go link up with Tig. Wow. Off rip, Osaka looks just like Las Vegas to me. The roads, the buildings, the everything. It reminds me of home away from home in a way. We got a lot to do today, and we also have some very interesting people to link with as well. Can't say too much, but y'all see the title. Let's go over here and let's go. Now. This gonna be tough, bro. Finish white girl, she played tennis. Um, yeah, brand new Rafi, brand new Ricky. Tell him, send it. Um, yeah, brand winner. Yeah, Lambo. Yeah, I've been. Yeah, fit. How you doing, man? Good. Say what up? Say what up? Takoyaki. Takoyaki. Man, this is lit. It feels like he's me, man. Takoyaki. Takoyaki, Takoyaki. What up? Yeah. Yeah, man, nice to meet you. Nice Where to meet you. Where we at? 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 Where but the slang version is called Me Na Me. Remember, me Na Me. All right. Y'all know we in slang, so Me Na Me it is, me man. Me. This dude is yeah. just like me, man. Oh, my God. All right. Great people. I'm my twin out here in Japan, bro. Osaka Takoyaki sold a food on that daddy. Takoyaki, bro. Bully. He said hey, a yo. local food called what? Takoyaki. What is it made out of? Octopus ain't it? Octopus? Osaka. 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 See, in the U.S., a taco look like a... Yeah, octopus. Salapan? This don't look like a taco. This look like a a bowling ball or something. Takoyaki. 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 Damn, bro. I'm trying to eat some takoyaki, bro. They ain't talking about that, bro. That shit sounds good, bro. Okay. It might be too hot to eat. Bro, it's hot. It was like hell, bro. That shit was fresh off the van. I don't even know how it tastes. It was so hot. Bro, boy, I just scratched my tongue. Takoyaki, man. Go ahead. Please. My entire tongue, bro. He tried to set me up, bro. Did you grow up here? Born here, but not raised here. Okay. This is a place he always, like, do business, and he do, like, the what is the difference between here and Tokyo? Their vibes better. What? Vibes, vibes. The vibes, the vibes is better. Most people here don't have any tattoos, and you even have them on your face. Do people treat you differently for having tattoos out here? They actually treat them not good. Okay. Yeah, have a nine to five. He gets stared a lot. Mm -hmm. So it's mm. trouble sometimes. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, people be staring because he got tattoos on. Okay, I see the I see the vision though. Yeah, there's the only two people with tattoos. At what age did you get your first face tattoo? Uh Jukyo said. So he got the heart right here when he was 19. That's his first Damn. tattoo. <laughs> yeah, he got right here. That's bold. To get a face tattoo, you got to be fully committed. At what point was you like, all right, I'm not trying to get no job or no nine to five job or anything? So ever since you were you been like this and you knew you didn't want to He was a youngin' and knew what it was, bro. Hikakebashi. Hikakebashi. 
This is the place to pick up girls or to hustle selling things to tourists. Oh. Oh, okay. So this right here is like the place you could pick up a girl or you trying to sell something to maybe a tourist or a local. I was saying to the camera, it reminds me so much of like Las Vegas here. What does that mean over there? So this is a real popular place. He's saying a lot of people will come here and they will take a picture in front of it. Kind of like if what you're in Hollywood, you go to the Hollywood Star, New York, you go to Times Square. And look at this view right here. This right here is beautiful. Growing up, did you get into like lots of fights and stuff like that? Yes, yes, yes. What's the craziest thing that you've seen here? Oh, oh wow. So seeing somebody get stabbed and his guts yeah, coming yeah. out. So we see the places here that if somebody's new here, it might look safe. Even though I know it's dangerous. Are there a lot of gangs in this area? Yeah, from what I've read, oh, they're damn. one of the most dangerous gangs in the whole country, right? <laughs> what other gangs are out here? Is it just them? Yeah, because I was going to say, they only, I've only ever heard of Yakuza. I didn't know that there was anything else in Japan. I don't know how to say it. Like, they're the best of gang members. Or like, probably like the most popular, mm -hmm. they're like the most right. popular gang out here. In like, America, there's like, Bloods, Crips. You go to a different state, there's like, GDs, BDs, there's all these different gangs depending on what state. In Japan, is it okay. only a few gangs out here? Yakuza that gang. It's only Yakuza. Pretend to be Bloods and Crips. Oh, wow. Got you. Okay. So, Halloween. 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 Why didn't you ever choose to, to join that gang or anything? Oh, he just wanted to. But if I'm ordered to kill someone, then I will kill. This nigga's a crash out. He is a top tier crash out. What he said? If I gotta, if they say I gotta catch a body, consider him dead. Like what? <coughs> I wanted to. I could even. I could. That's fine. That's fine. That used to be a reference mm, to Pretty okay. much you're saying like not something that oh I'ma just join for a few years and then oh I think this is too hard, let me get out. Once you join, you're committed. It's a brotherhood forever. How long have you been making music? We've been doing this over six years. What have first got you into doing it? So I was young, okay. Okay. Decided to do music because the bad thing, but I was. But you feel like making music made you born again in a way. Right. What's the music scene like out here? Is it different from Tokyo? Well, there are not really much difference. Less real ones in Tokyo than more real ones in Osaka. Do a lot of people here rap? A lot of people are starting to rap. Yo, that American rap scene is starting to do its due diligence worldwide. If you could work with any artist in the U.S., what artist would you work with? Chief Keef. Chief Keef. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Chief Keef watched my video, so I know he's he gonna see this. Yeah. yeah. Okay. How does someone <laughs> from this area find Chief Keef music? A song I don't like. Do you understand anything that the song say, or you just like the way it sounds? Is Look there at a uh, producer that you want to work with? Weezy. Weezy? Yeah. Weezy out of here. Okay, okay, lit, lit. Okay. This is my, uh, this is my friend, you thug. He is, he's a rapper as well. Check his music out down below. Oh, I thought he was security. I ain't gonna lie to you. I thought bro was security, but hey, W bro. Wagyu place? Bro, I wanna try... I wanna try Wagyu, bro. Damn. 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 Damn, this shit looks so good, dummy. Oh my gosh, bro. I remember like, yo, bro, I went to one of them, but it wasn't Japanese though, bro. It was Korean. I feel like the Japanese would still hit crazy, bro. I'm trying to get to it. Damn. See this right here? Never do this in Japan. When you did this, it's the thing when you do it, a funeral in front of a body. That's for them who passed away. Oh, don't do this? Yeah, no, don't do this. Point it to me. Yeah. 
So only if they're older. If they're younger, I could do this. Yeah. 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 Don't do this. Yeah. Yeah. Never. 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 So how do I supposed to do it? This or so, so I'm left-handed. So facing right. Yeah, right. Yeah. This either. This one is also something we do at funeral too. Not funeral, but like we burn a body and then okay. it, it come out as a bone, right? And then we take a bone. This oh, we, we, we can't can both grab it at the same time. No. Oh yeah, don't stab it. Yeah, no, no. Oh, don't stab it. Like pick them. No. Okay. Well, what if it's chilling like this? Oh, well, that's not a problem. Just standing like straight. This is not cool. After Sit up chair. Okay. Time to meet the Yakuza. When people think of the Yakuza, they yeah. think of older, retired people. Yo, what the hell? I like this aesthetic. This shit look tough. But today, nearly 40% of their members are in their 20s and 30s. They rarely do interviews. And because they're amongst the world's richest gangs, even money won't make them speak out publicly. When I tell y'all this felt like straight out of a movie, dim lit back room, hidden in plain sight, with the Yakuza suited up, waiting on my arrival, that's exactly what this was. Yeah. Trying to finally meet them. This shit look tough, bro. Beauty. Before we continue with this video, y'all, this video is sponsored by Price Picks. Dang, I knew. I was waiting for the bullshit. Okay, though. I was waiting about for it. About to get now. way crazier. It's your 40 picks. All right, y'all. This is the most serious part of the video. Uh, definitely something that no YouTuber has done. Today, we're in a private secret location, and we're about to do a full interview with the Yakuza. That's enough talking. It's time to go and meet them for ourselves. Damn! That nigga's just... That's what I'm saying. Them niggas is, huh? Hey, touch them. Got the Yakuza here. Everybody has masks. Their identities don't want to be shown. We're in a small space right now, so we're all crammed up. I guess first question, why is it so important to hide who you are? We're covering our faces because we don't want to be identified. Nigga, that was easy. Why did why did he why did he ask that? We do stuff illegal sometimes. Okay. Got you. What is the the joining process like? How exactly do they have to go about joining? We only need guts to be Yakuza for life. We only need guts to be a Yakuza for life. Okay. When y'all are looking for people to join, do y'all go and search for people to join or do people come to y'all and ask? When y'all are trying to find people that y'all want to uh, bring in, what exactly are characteristics that y'all are like trying to look for? Bad kids. Bad kids. When you find somebody, how do you know that, okay, I can trust this person to be part of the gang? If you can kill... Wait, what? This person to be part of the gang. If you can kill... Oh, if you can kill or not. Okay. Mm. And say if someone wants to join and you have them go do something for you and they come back and don't get the job done, how is that process like? Do you just kick them out or do they get in trouble for not doing everything that you asked for? He's a, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. For not doing everything that you asked for. It depends. He's sometimes kicked out or we teach him. So, um, I see everybody has on suits. Why the suits? Do everybody have to dress in suits if they join? Or is that how y'all carry yourself every day? It's Japanese culture, like salarymen. Okay, 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 I'm getting the vibe. Okay. I see everybody has nice jewelry and everything. When someone joins, do they get money given to them? It's by working. Are y'all faces known by lots of cops? Yes. Let's say a cop just sees you out living your regular life. How do they treat y'all when they see y'all? They're trying to look for something they committed to a different job. Got you, got jail. you. Now, okay. if, let's say the cops find y'all and try to take y'all to jail. Do y'all get extra time because y'all are in a gang? Yeah. I've seen online okay. a lot of people have <coughs> tattoos, their whole full body's covered. Is that something that everybody has to do once they join? Or is it a certain tattoo? No. 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 You have to get tattoos, but it's Japan, Japanese culture. Okay. If you're in a gang, you automatically get some. Okay. He looks scared like shit, bro. I understand it though. These are some. These are the real deal niggas. Hey, y'all being in a gang, are y'all able to just look at somebody else that lives here and tell they're in a gang, whether it's a certain way that they dress? carry themselves whether it's a certain tattoo and be able to tell that okay this person is in a gang of, of some sort um, uh, there are some people who are able to tell how does somebody move up in rank how does someone move up from somebody who just joined the gang to all the way up to like a leader or a boss a 
much work you do is how much you can go up. Okay. How how fast can someone do it? Is that how it works? Um, do you have any like rival gangs? How do you think the gang culture here is different from the gang culture in the United States? We don't do drugs. Dang, so they obviously so they work militant. Everything that they do is just like sober. So it's like I just feel like it's more intense. That's okay. Okay. So it's is drug culture not a thing here compared to like in the in the US? Do most people not do drugs? People do, but Okay, that's interesting. Okay. Was any of y'all young when y'all had y'all just got confused here. first tattoo? Yeah. Yeah. Um, are we able to see any tattoo of y'all's? What does that tattoo mean? Bonji. It's a dead now a dead language. Bonji are written characters that are developed in ancient India and brought to Japan. Oh, so nobody uses those no more. Okay. What's that? It's called Bonji. I don't know if that's explaining actually, but it's Japanese culture. Do any of y'all have your whole body tattooed? Oh, these niggas is scrapped. When y'all have kids, would y'all want them to join the gang as well? Or would y'all want to keep y'all kids away from that? It's not my choice. I will let them choose their life. Um, would that be, would he tell um, his kid that he's in a gang or would that be something that he'll try to hide from them for as long as he can? Yeah, yeah. So I, I see your hand and I see that you're missing a uh, finger over there. Uh, you mind explaining what Picture of a missing finger on my Instagram. Okay. What happened and how you lost it? Took responsibility. Was it something that you chose to do, or was it a request from somebody else that you should get your finger cut off? Okay. When you join, why did you choose to join? It was the okay. right thing to do. Um, did, did any of y'all join for safety reasons? In the U.S., joining a gang, a lot of people have to because of where they're at. It's either they join a gang and the neighborhood help them be safe, or they have to go out on their own okay. with no backup. Did any of y'all join to have a backup and feel safe? You've been a bad kid since you were a teenager. end up in your adulthood. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's the way a samurai lives. Uh, not many people get to speak with Yakuza. Because their identities are hidden, it's common to be walking the streets and not knowing you're passing by a member of Japan's most dangerous gang. A few of them traveled four hours just for this video. It's moments like these where you sit back and think, how the hell this all started? All year I'm traveling the world and meeting people learning about different ways of life outside of the norm. Wow. I just posted new pictures with the Yakuza on Instagram. If you go comment here from YouTube, Damn. and comment on this video and let me know where y'all want to see me go next. From Osaka, signing out. Plug came in and he had one point left. We did a show. Yo, what the hell? Booty, this shit is crazy. Phone, this nigga went stupid. Yeah. But if I'm ordered to kill someone, then I will kill. This nigga's a crash out.